Morning everyone. Well, another day, another cycle. Um, certainly getting fit doing this. So, I'm surrounded by um, ravens and squirrels at the moment. So, uh, a little bit worrying. But uh, the plan today is to do a bit of a reset. I normally find after I pack things and uh, everything gets in a complete mess. So, I want to get home. I want to photograph some stuff. I want to get a handful of items on maybe five or six, maybe those geese, and um, then just tidy up. I always try and keep on top of tidying, or like to think I try, um, but a lot of the time fail, so I just always keep pushing at it to try and keep tidy. Um, anyway, I will film a little bit every hour or so and uh, let you know how the day goes. There are tons of these squirrels in this park, absolutely hundreds, and you don't feed them, otherwise they'd be in your bags and uh, stealing your nuts. But um, and there is an albino one around here somewhere, which um, we've called out. But well, there we go. Right, I better go, otherwise they'll be jumping on me and mugging me. Right, I've been listening for about a couple of hours. Um, I came in and sort of thought, shall I tidy or shall I list? And I went for the listing because um, I like doing listing in the morning because it's a definite thing that you can get done and finished and say I've achieved something in the day. Um, and um, sometimes I might do batches of photographs, but like I do like just getting a handful of listings done and completed. So even if it's easier for me to photograph five items and then list five items, I might actually do the one just to get the one um, on and like up and running. Um, I'm going to show you something. I'm also going to drop something. Um, this, now I moan about charity shops and you, you know, may think that's a bit harsh, but I bought, bought this in a charity shop the other day. It was only £1.99, so... Um, and it was all sellotaped up with sort of complete written on it. And I should have known better, really. Um, I got home. And normally what's missing on these is the hexagons. Um, I won't open it. But not this time. All the hexagons are there. But um, almost all of the answer cards are there. And you do think, why do charity shops do it? And um, around here, you get it a lot. You know, you buy, you might buy a Lego. I, I checked a Lego once in there and I say, no, it's complete. Had completely no minifigures and like loads of the bits missing. And to me, it's just trying to pull a fast one. You know, I wouldn't like it if an eBay seller did it to me. And I don't like it if a charity shop seller does it to me. Do, do it properly. You know, there's no good being half assed on this sort of thing or thinking you can get away with things. Describe things properly. If it's incomplete, describe it as incomplete and I still might buy it, but I won't get hacked off. Anyway, um, what I'll do with this, I'm not going to keep this massive great big box. I very much doubt whether one day I'm going to get the um, sort of 200 question cards that are missing. So I will um, keep all the hexagons because normally when you buy this, that's the sort of thing that's missing. Um, but everything else will be chucked away. The big blockbuster board. Um, things like that. Um, let me show you something else. Hang on a sec. Yeah, I've just had a delivery um, from Parcel Force, and this is a 13 kilogram, I think, uh, box of jewellery. This is this is what it looks like. This is the size of it. It's it's heavy. It's 13 kilograms. Um, but this has come through from Tom, and um, I'm not going to open it because I'll go down a rabbit hole of going, oh look at that, look at this. But this is my backup. If I ever sort of run out of stock, I would open that and start going through jewellery. So it's all, you know, it's all unsorted and, you know, could be anything in there. It's a bit of a bit of a lucky dip, really, a bit of a treasure trove. But I've got a couple of these boxes and it's good to know that there is something to sort um, should I need it. Um, I'm going to have a cup of tea now and then uh, crack on with some more work. And let me flip this around. Yeah, now I've done that bit of listing, um, I feel like I can spend like a couple of hours, good hours, tidying. And I yeah, I won't sort of finish that and think, what have I actually achieved? And yeah, I have done my handful of listing and got some stuff on, so that's good. But anyway, tea's the most important thing, and uh, possibly biscuits too. 
just done a very quick bit of testing. This was lying around doing nothing, um, getting in the way, and um, yeah, just stuck my variable power supply in it and got a game. Um, it's a Master System 2, which um, I've never had or sold, um, so I have got a controller for that. So, but I'm just glad it powers up. That's good. Um, I'm going to put some stuff on um, in my storage now uh, that I've been listed. So I'll show you what I've listed this morning. Yeah, this is it. It's nothing uh, that was really too difficult to list. Probably about a dozen items in there. Jigsaws, games, a few electronic items in there. Um, a couple of PS Move controllers. And some of it was um, bits of which have been sort of half-drafted but not finished off. Um, some bits from yesterday, those shoes from yesterday. Um, but yes, 12 items all completely finished and put on. And I will carry on drafting and listing today. But that... That is going on my um, storage shelves now, so it's not sort of lying around. It'll be all neatly put away, which is nice. Right, I have got one thing to pack. Um, I went to the Royal Mail yesterday, um, but I didn't go to Hermes. So this was outstanding. It is a PS2 controller, wheel, steering wheel and pedals. So it's not the easiest thing to pack, but, you know, it should be all right if I get a big enough box for it. So get that done. That's the only thing I've got to pack. I haven't had any sales today. And like I say, I went to the post office yesterday and cleared down. I like doing that and give myself like a, a free run of a few days. Um, so yeah, that to do. And then back on with a bit of listing, I think. Well, I'm just finishing up the day by um, doing some listing. And um, one of the Blockbusters spare parts that I listed earlier has sold the dice. Don't know if I underpriced my dice. It was two pound fifty three post, but um, that's gone well on its way to uh, paying for that incomplete game from the charity shop. And I've also had a hundred and fifty pound sale on um, a Samsung DVD VHS video recorder, which I thought I was priced quite high actually, um, and that was listed today. So um, good news that that's gone straight away. Yeah, that's gone for a hundred and fifty plus. £6.49 postage, don't quite know why I put that on. I think it will cost about £7.99 um, to go via UPS. So um, a bit more packing to do, I'll probably do that tomorrow. Um, but everything, it's been a really good day today, you know, got some stuff listed to start with, had a good old tidy up and um, there wasn't a lot to pack because uh, we'd already done most of it yesterday. And um, I might try and do a bit of sourcing tomorrow maybe, you know, online. I'm not really good at that, um, but we'll see how that goes. I'm going to upload this now um, and see if I get a few more viewers than yesterday. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Take care and I'll see you soon. Oh, and I almost forgot to say, if you do like these videos, do uh, click the like button and uh, subscribe if you're not. If you don't like these videos, uh, do let us know what you don't like about them. Use the uh, comments below to feedback. Um, I do notice they don't get as many views as my um, haul videos. So um, if there's something you want to see on the channel, just uh, put it in the comments and I'll uh, try and do that for you. Anyway, for now, take care. See you later.